everybody. Uh, if you've watched my very first video where I'm showing you how to make these never wet beetle barrier flanges, and you know that I went through multitudes of different materials, well, I saw one that came up and it's kind of struck my fancy a little bit, and it was this uh, Reynolds wrap, but it says non stick. So I read about it, and they've put a silicone type surface on it, so when you bake with it, foods don't stick. So now I'm thinking, can I apply this to the small hive beetle problem? I already know that the never wet works, but I figured, you know, why not try something else? So I got the Reynolds wrap, the no stick. I tried a little test with the water just to see how it would beat up, and it beats up quite well. And on the foil itself, you've got a shiny side and a dull side. The dull side is the non-stick. So what I did is I wrapped, I dug the high beetle theater back out, I wrapped the aluminum flanges with the aluminum foil, and uh, got it all set up, went out in the bee yard this morning, got some more high beetles, and uh, put them in there. So knowing all that, I just wanted to let everybody who is thinking about trying this, they can see the results for themselves. And uh, we'll start um, Hive Beetle Theater Episode 2. All right. We're all set up. I'm going to, uh, there's one on the top there, get him down. I'm going to start poking at them to get them to walk around, and you'll um, see the reaction to the, to the aluminum coated there, just walking. Well, one's gotten out already. Put him back in. So you, you can see that this has got a, uh, a silicone surface on it, and that is not even stopping them. A no-stick silicone surface. So there goes another one got out. So they are walking. This right here is the um, same material, but I just put it on the side to see what the effects that would be. And this right back here is the same thing. It's just coated with a, the no-stick aluminum foil. So um, as far as a um, hive beetle type uh, deterrent, I would have to say this is a complete failure, but now everybody knows anyway. So I'll let this run a little bit longer just to show you how these beetles react to this, which is not, if not even a problem for them. And these things can literally walk on anything except the never wet. The never wet has been the only substance that they cannot walk on. It just stops them dead. Yeah, they're just walking all over it. Like it's not even there. There goes another one out. Anyway, folks, there's, um, they're getting out on a regular basis. So I just want to show you that, uh, you know, I'm still searching. Uh, I'm still going to stay with the never what I think. That seems to be the magic bullet as far as what works. But I just want to um, show you what kind of testing goes into... Uh, trying to figure out what surface material to use. Anyway, this is all from uh, my secret lab in Milton, Florida. So, signing off for now.